that, that you think happened? Was it those collapsing, a bit of a collapse at the end that just stopped you from being able to get over the line? Yeah, definitely. I think losing Mignon, myself, and also Georgia, and almost in a consecutive hopeless, and I think that that definitely cost us the game. One of us had to stop. Uh, one of our um, KPIs is definitely having one of the top four to bat through the 20 overs, and that did not happen today, so I would reckon that's the issue. But on a personal note, you were looking very comfortable out there. Not normally known for your big hitting, but it looked like you were going for some today. You find you're almost looking at some of the other players around and like, oh, I'm at the other end of George Redmond, I'm going to have a bit of a hit too. I actually went back and worked yesterday and I did uh, talk to Julia Price and also Mignon, worked with Mignon as well, both of them, and they just asked me to keep it simple. I was trying to hit too hard the first game, but I think I just tried to keep it simple uh, this game and just go with the flow. Yeah, and Yasmin, what's it like being part of this team? Obviously, you're a crucial member of this. You took that fantastic catch just out on the boundary earlier. What's the vibe like in the Warriors, even with two losses from two games? Yeah, it's just a privilege being here um, as an associate uh, member. I think um, the bunch have been really like happy, and you know, when a person makes a mistake, no one, no one is um, really on you that much. So it kind of gives you that freedom just to express yourself. So yeah, pretty happy. And so going forward, what will you be looking at to try and get that first win, Cindy? I think uh, our main objective is definitely to get better game after game. And if you saw, I think we were better than the first game. So I think we're just going to go out and you know, better ourselves than what we were today. Definitely go out there for the win and for the next three wins and you know, put us on the board. Yeah, and um, for... You personally, though, you can think about you've got that extra batting point early on, so that's something looking forward into, you know, because when it comes down to the, the business end of the competition, that's something that could come into play. So is that something that also plays on your mind as you're batting? Oh, yes, definitely. And I think that's something that we were always aware of. We were first going for the bonus point, And if we, we knew if we were going for the bonus point, that means we were in a good run rate to chase the score down. So we, were def we definitely have that in our plans. Yeah, and we've got a question come in here from Mohit Shah. Did the pitch get slower towards the end? Because you seem to be in control of the chase for the first 15 overs, or was it just a tricky pitch? No, I think I believe they bowled brilliantly, and I think they cut the pace off the ball, and that, that's what you know, got us a little bit on the back foot, because we had to create shots then going forward. So the ball wasn't coming on, and it was the same in the beginning as well, but they bowled brilliantly. And for you as a team, um, what will you go ahead, away and look at between now and your next game? Will you sort of you have to put this one to the side or will it be more of an analysis of these two games or the two losses? Well, we, t we ticked off a lot of boxes. If you see 150 was a pretty good score and we also had a very good partnership going in and we were in the game almost until the 16th over. So we did everything right until the four overs. So we're not going to uh, go back and think too much about it and try and, you know, tick off all the boxes and talk a little bit about tomorrow's reviews and uh, go for it. Yeah, and Yasmin, going ahead into the next game, what's the plan for all of you? Will you just come together as a team, uh, put your feet up a bit and just look ahead to your next match? Yeah, I think um, going back and just reflect on what happened. I think, yeah, as Cindy mentioned, we didn't do much wrong um, until, yeah, obviously the 16th over. So, yeah, I think um, everyone's just going to go chill a bit and, yeah, coming back stronger tomorrow. Yeah, and that's the thing. As a team, there are still a lot of positives to take away from this one. You've got the bonus point. There's some great performances. So we look forward to seeing you in your next game. We'll let you go, get some dinner, 